Hi everyone! You know, I'm going to give you a couple of guesses on what today is, just in case you didn't read the title. Do you, can you tell? Can you tell from what I'm wearing? Can you tell from my hat? You know what today is? It's Timu Tuesday. Hi everyone! I'm Nancy and welcome back to my channel. To my viewers, my subscribers, you guys are awesome. Thank you so much from the bottom of my heart. It means so much to me that you're able to take a few minutes out of your day to spend with me. I appreciate it more than you'll ever know. If you're new to my channel, I hope you would take a quick second. Hit that little red subscribe button over there. I would love for you to join our YouTube family and get to know you. So I hope that you subscribe and come back and see us again. I hope everyone gives this video a thumbs up. Your comments, of course, are always, always welcome. So today we are going to be having a... Timu Tuesday. The bag looks like it's in pretty rough shape. I didn't order a lot of things in here, so I'm sure everything in here is fine. But what I'm going to do is, because I know it's going to be jam-packed in here with cellophane wrappers and things like that, so I'm going to take everything out of there and get it kind of organized. I think I got a dress in here. I may have two dresses in here. I think I've got two wigs. So, We'll do a little try on for you as well. So anyway, I hope you guys stick around and we will be right back. Alrighty, so I'm back. I have no idea why I did that because I knew I wasn't changing. All I was doing was opening the bag and getting things ready. But anyway, just got a few things so it's going to be a really quick video. I got two dresses. I got a wig to go with each one. I got some lipstick and I got these peonies. Now, I love my peony flowers, but, you know, when you bring there, just when I start opening up and maybe the ants help, whatever, but they just seem to be covered with, with ants, and I don't want to spray them with Raid because then they don't finish opening, and I don't want to bring them in the house with, with bugs all over them. So I got this bouquet of faux peony flowers, and these were $6.69. They had a really long stem, which it was just way too big for this and I tried hacking and cutting it and I know I've got probably wire cutters out. I've got like do I have three floor to over my head two boxes out in the garage. I have no idea what's in them but I know I probably have wire cutters in there. But anyway so these are the pink peonies flowers. The inside on some of them are a little bit darker. They got that burgundy color inside. We got some leaves and then this uh these things, a couple of these things. So I just kind of bent it as much as I could to get it to stay in these uh, little glass beads. So I will have to play with that. Um, definitely cut it so it's going to lay flatter and then kind of open these up a little bit as they probably get a little bit more relaxed. But anyway, I thought they would make a nice little springtime or summer bouquet. Alrighty, so then the next thing I got was this lipstick. Now it was called, a, it's called a lip stain matte, but the color that I picked, it was $2.24, was called Diamond Glitter. And on the website, it really looked like it was going to be a nice lip gloss with sparkles, so I thought this is perfect for me. But anyway, it, it is a matte, or it looks like a matte color anyway, but it doesn't look that bad. It kind of looks like a soft peachy pink, so it looks like a nice spring color. And again, it's classic vivid. It comes with this kind of doe foot applicator right there. And I try putting, so that's the color right there. So it doesn't really look too, too bad, right? And I am really bad at doing this on camera, but. I think you can see it a little bit. I don't know how people do it, like, uh, like Bailey Sarian and some others, Danielle Christie or Kirsty, the other one I watch, how they put lipstick on and they're still talking and carrying on a conversation. I have no idea how they do it. But anyway, that's a color. I don't think it's too bad. And of course, if I put a highlighter on top of it, I'll get that kind of glossy look that I love. So $2.24 for that. And I really, really like that rockabilly dress that I got a couple of weeks ago with the black and white polka dots with the sweetheart neckline. So they had that same dress in this blue color. 
So again, it's got the black outline, black for the sweetheart neckline, that little tie, and then it's like a bright kind of blue, not really royal. I'm not really sure what kind of blue we want to call this, but we've got the polka dots, nice wide skirt, and then the two black ribbons kind of highlighting the bottom of that. And that's $17.89. And the white and black one was stretchy. This one's got a little bit of stretch too, so that should be comfortable. Just have the zipper background. Ah, background, the zipper in the back. It's like an invisible zipper. So I really enjoy those. And again, that was $17.89. And the other dress just slid off my lap. And this one was, it's a full length, it's a maxi dress. And it's the same material as that other dress that I got the last my last Timu. So it's a like a real kind of silk material. There's no give in it, but the dress is really pretty. And this one was called a floral print pocket dress for eleven dollars and nineteen cents. On the neckline here, it's got that little ring right there, just just a little tiny keyhole, and it's white. And we got like maybe some cherry blossoms on it, and then black and white and again it is a full length and it, it just feels like silk there's not really much given it so I'm not really sure how it's going to fit if it's going to be kind of snug or whatever but we will give this a try and again that was $11.19 and we got a wig to go with this one and a wig to go with the blue one and you're probably saying Nancy Nancy, 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 you just got a blue wig not too long ago. You already had one from Halloween. Do you need three wigs? Probably not. But anyway, I thought this color looked like it would go better with that dress. That's my excuse. That's my story. I'm sticking to it. So anyway, I'm going to go quick try those on, see how they fit, and uh, try those wigs on, and we will be right back. Alrighty, so I'm back. So this is the wig and it's got like the dark uh, ends here and the dark darker roots and then it's kind of like a kind of silvery blonde in the middle and this one it's called the ombre brown platinum this one was eleven dollars 24 cents and i did didn't have my scissors on me so i still got the price tag on the wig which makes it really hard to brush um it's got the bangs come down to here so i just if i I will probably just kind of do it like that so I don't have to figure out how to cut them and the dress. So again, this dress was $11.19 and my infamous and bat wings are back because yeah, I don't, I don't have anything here. So yeah, nothing fills out. So, um, I would have to tack these down. Um, it doesn't go down too low right there. It does have side pockets. I have no idea about these pockets because they just kind of stick out and they just kind of look funny. But anyway, the dress itself is really pretty. Again, I just have to tack those down and that'll fit you probably can see the better on this side where the pocket is right here it's so of course if i lose some inches then it will fit a little bit different but it does have a, a better fit than the other one it's not tight it does go all the way down to the floor and i do um you know everything because i am so fair skinned everything just seems to really white here white myself out so maybe with a like a darker a statement black necklace or just with something bolder it won't look so pale right here and then of course once I tack those down it'll look a little bit better so anyway let's go try on the blue one hoping hoping that it fits as good as the uh, black and white one so we will be right back Alrighty, so I'm back. Um, this blue wig as much as I really love the color and I love the blue wigs it isn't exactly what I thought it was going to be. So it was called a blue bob, blue bob wig with bangs. It was eight dollars and ninety nine cents. Um, I do have to, if I want to not do this, I'm going to have to figure out the bangs. Right now, the bangs go down to about here, so they definitely need to be cut. Um, it was supposed to be like a bob, like this length, and which is kind of like what I was looking for, just like an easy care wig that I didn't have to worry about getting tangled, whatever. So I might still look for one coming in around this length. But anyway, for $8.99, I think it's really cool. I just have to figure out the bangs and I think it will be wearable. And of course, I, it matches these earrings that I got from Shane last year last year so anyway loving these earrings from Shane of course that's touchstone crystal 
We've got a Timu ring right here. That's a Timu ring. Turn that around so you can see it. That one's from Shane, and that one's from Shane. And, oh, that lip stain that I tried. Oh, my gosh, this, this is not washing off. So I've washed my hands like three times trying to get that off and scrubbing and it's it's not coming off. I even used an exfoliator on it to try to, it's not coming off. It was not coming off my lips. I had a white lipstick that I got to tone things down. So I put that on it and then I put highlighter all over my lips to make them light. Yeah, this is, this is a stain. It's not going anywhere. I have no idea how long it lasts, but it is probably going to go right into the, uh, my empties bucket for something I'm not keeping. Alrighty, and for $2.24, it was definitely worth a try, and of course I have to, I really have to cut these bangs. But the Rockabilly dress, now they're calling it the polka dot, and they're calling it a Audrey Hepburn style, $17.89. I love the style. I've just always called it Rockabilly. And for $17.89, I think that's a good price for it. It's like the one that I got a couple of weeks ago that was a black and white polka dot one. So we've got this uh, black band right here and then the sweetheart neckline. This little bow tie that, yeah, it's not going to look like this after I wash it. I have no idea why we have to have this cut out here. I think just having just the black go all the way down would look so much better. But anyway, that's how it is. Um, it's a nice fit and fit and flare, and of course, it's got plenty of room to put a petticoat on underneath. I just kept my leggings on for now. The bottom has those um, little black ribbons that go around the length of, or the circum, you know what I mean, all the way around the dress it goes. So anyway, there's plenty of room in here to put a petticoat under, and I just kind of love that style, doing wine diaries and things in the summer. To me, it's just a fun party dress. But anyway, so that is everything that I got. Like I said, this is just a really, really little tiny baby mini haul. So I got these two wigs. I really like the other one better. That ombre style with the platinum. I love that color platinum right in here with the dark roots and then the dark ends. And that one was uh, only $11.24. I really do like that one. And that's a nice length as well. The black and white dress. Really love the style on that. I don't know why they keep people keep putting in those side pockets. They don't lay flat. And then to have it, I mean, if it was black inside the pocket, it probably would have looked a lot better. But because it's like stark white, it just looks messy. So, but I am still working on my under desk elliptical. So maybe there's hope. Maybe it'll lay a little bit flatter. And then, of course, I've got those bat wings because, yeah, I don't have anything here. So they just kind of stick out. But that's easy enough to tack down, which I've learned to do quite a bit lately. And uh, yeah, so that was only $11.19. The lip stain, $2.24. This dress, $17.89. These peonies that I think are going to lay a little bit flatter as they kind of relax from being uh, shipped from overseas and stuffed inside a bag. So I think as they relax, they're going to look a little bit better. And then if I get a, a really nice wire cutter, I can cut that bottom too so it will lay a little bit flatter. And that was $6.69. So anyway, I am happy with this haul. This wig wasn't exactly what I thought it was going to be, but for $8.99, it's a keeper. And have you tried any of these wigs? Aren't they fun? <sighs> so anyway, I want to thank you guys so much for taking a few minutes out of your day to spend with me. It means so much to me, and I am looking forward to watching all your hauls and adding to my shopping list. It's a lot of fun. I do have that affiliate code be beneath in my description. So if you are new to Timo and you haven't ordered yet, using my link is going to give you 30% off your first order. And it's just a really, really fun site to go and just there's something something for everyone so anyway thank you guys so much for taking taking a few minutes out of your day with me oh it's tuesday tomorrow's wine wednesday or hump day wednesday or wacky wednesday wellness wednesday whatever you want to call it it's wednesday halfway through the week i hope you guys have a fabulous fabulous week take care everyone stay safe be kind be happy enjoy life have some fun and we will see you in our next video love you guys Bye-bye.